Welcome back to the show. BYU's victory over Gonzaga was an upset that no one saw coming <laughs> except Dana Green. I saw it coming. There's so much post-game sound from last night that we're dedicating the entirety of Bites of the Week to it. Yeah, we're heading into the BYU locker room with Mark Pope's new <laughs> suit to kick off this week's edition of Bites of the Week. Hey! Hey! Listen, this is a brand new custom suit. So let's move! It was very quiet and reserved, and um, it was it was the same as it was on the court after the game. You know, um, it's just happy. You could be in this business for for 50 years and not get that night, and these guys got it. And so I, I I don't know about any broader picture things, but that just makes me happy. There's magic that happens in March, and so when you have a lot of momentum and you got some magic going, uh, it's going to be really good for us. And so this is definitely a huge momentum builder for us, and um, it's a great win for us. We fight, and we love each other. And so on a night like tonight, a team that fights and a team that loves each other and plays for each other, that's what happens, man. We go out there and we play for play for everything and we, we, we get it done. I was in the tunnel and I, I started I started tearing up a little bit and it was like we'll cry after bro, we'll cry after. It was amazing. That is this place is is unbelievable and these fans are incredible. I think uh, we're all gonna remember where we were tonight and and the feeling that we had in that building. You know BYU <coughs> Bro I said I wouldn't get emotional. I gotta relax. Come on. Like BYU will always be home to me. And I was a little irritated because they were so great tonight that I almost started crying before the game. I'm like, I gotta focus on the game. But they were they were amazing all night long. Reflecting on my journey here, um, you know, coming back, it's it's crazy. But I, I couldn't be more grateful for for this opportunity and, and to be on this team, man. These these guys are amazing, and, and I truly love them. Tough question. One word. Should we say it on three? Oh, yeah, let's do it. You two. What do we say? Dalton's word. What is it? Dalton's word. Dalton. Dalton. Dalton's word? Yeah. That is. Three series. <laughs> you know it. All right. Let's right, we'll see if we can do it. I don't know. Ready? One, One two, two, three. three. Toughness. Five. Oh, what'd you say? <laughs> what did you say, bro? What did fight. you say? What'd you say? I said fight. Fight? It's the same word. Same thing. Same word. Same thing. That's fight. what. Toughness. toughness, fight, toughness. Same thing. Right. You got to get the Legendary. point. We fought. We fought for each other tonight. Yeah. With toughness. I mean, you know why that makes me so happy? Because it means we have room to grow, right? I mean, you might think that we got it all covered, but then I got two guys saying, one guy saying fight and two guys saying toughness. Not just tonight, but everything that's led these guys to get here tonight is, um, it's, it's, it's just everything that's good about sport. And you don't get it, you're always chasing it, and it's elusive, and then once in a while you get it, and it's really special. So you can choose one word out of that rambling sentence somewhere in there, but that's how I feel. How about toughness and fight, huh? I like it. <laughs>